Well, another day, another <laughs> blue sky, and where are we today, team? We're in Praia de Roca. Wow. Now, I always get confused. Is Praia de Roca Porto Mayo? Or, or is it Praia right. de Roca? Because we don't know, do no. we? They're kind of so near to one another, it's kind of hard to know, isn't it? I think the difference is <laughs> Porto Mayo is technically on a river. Right. And Praia de Roca is on the ocean. So I'm thinking that's the ocean that we can hear behind us. It is. So pretty sure we're at Praia de Roca. Anyway, this is some beautiful coastline. It's just gorgeous seeing some of these rock formations on the beach. That's beautiful. so typical of Portugal, isn't it, Tim? Oh, just look at that. In fact, the waves are looking really quite smooth today. So this is looking west at Praia de Roca from the lookout and it's just absolutely stunning. This down here is a fish restaurant so you can go and have dinner down here. Um, but it's too early in the season for that to be open. Yeah, but look at the rock formations oh. over here. It's so typical of the Algarve. So here's the other side to where we were just standing <laughs> a minute ago, team. Yeah. So you can really see the whole of the ocean front accommodation at Praia de Roca behind us. And there are lots of apartment buildings here, aren't there? There are. It's a very popular spot mm -hmm. in the Algarve. So if you don't want to be in the hustle and bustle of uh, the party town in Albufeira, <laughs> you can be in the hustle and bustle, bustle. of the party town of Praia de Roca. Praia de Roca. It's yeah. another really neat place. So we'll just show you behind us. There's lots of apartments, but if you also notice, there's a huge expanse of beach norm in front of them. There is. So this is what it's all about really, isn't it, Tane? Just wide open beaches. Hardly anybody here because it's January, but it's <laughs> deserted. Um, around 17 degrees at the moment. It's yeah. early morning and a few people walking on the beach. Yeah. Just absolutely beautiful. And then you can see the hotels and apartments lining it. So this is one of the other attractions of being here in Praia de Roca is beautiful beach. Okay, team, let's get on these steps down to the boardwalk in Praia de Roca. Wow. It's our favorite activity. That's so pretty because there's like little flowers growing out of rocks. And but it's very well done, isn't it? How they make access yeah. for the people to come down from the cliff tops it's to all incorporated, the beach. Isn't it? And this is just a, a beautiful situation. Wow, now we're down looking up at the rocks. And this is what we can see on the beach. Wow, the wind's dropped down here now. Wow, look at that. So that's where we were just a few moments Stood ago. Stood up at the top and now we're down at the bottom. So this is very typical of the restaurants that are down on the beach at Praia de Roca. Um, there's a boardwalk and it's just a beautiful bar and restaurant. I know. A little right? early in the season though. I imagine in the summer this is just hopping with people. So we're walking down the boardwalk. It's just beautiful, isn't it? That's really nice. Been lucky with the weather today. Wow, yeah. We didn't get out yesterday. No, it, it was, was raining. It was raining. So we had an indoor day. <laughs> but today the blue sky came out, so off we went. Yeah, so we just take our opportunities when we can. We join you walk along the beach in in Porto Praia, Mayo, Praia de Roca. Praia de Roca. We I have no think. idea where we are. Actually, I think it's We're somewhere. I think it's Praia de Roca now. Yeah, we are. I'm it's just having a bit of fun with you. <laughs> anyway. We're, we're having a great time just yeah. walking along and the oceans, you can just hear the ocean lapping. We can and it's indeed. it's very nice. And it's lunchtime and I'm starving. <laughs> And everywhere's closed. Yeah, we might struggle to find somewhere <laughs> to eat. But this is just lovely, the way that they made this boardwalk. And it, it means that I can wear my beautiful brown leather shoes uh, yeah. on, on the beach and not get them ruined in the sand. Well, Tane, we found our entertainment for tonight <laughs> at the discotheque. The disco. Do you, do you remember doing that all those years ago? I do. 
Here we are, Praia do Roca, they have a discotheque. This is true. That'd be funky, wouldn't it? Yeah. Or are we too old for that now? Never too old. Do Never the, too do old. Do the funky chicken. <laughs> the other nice thing is, just on the other side of the discotheque, is the police station. So that's just opposite the discotheque. So obviously no trouble anticipated no. around here. <laughs> because so we were in Praia do Roca, and now we think we're in Porto Mayo. <laughs> Yes, we are. And this is where we were last time. We came down here and we thought this is all that was around for prayer or for Porto Mayo. And it's a nice little area. But this is a river that we can see in front of us. And it's not the ocean. It's the river that goes up to Silves. It is. The river Aras. And they actually have lots of little water fountains behind us. Yeah, I can feel myself yeah. getting wet. I can feel the spray <laughs> too. So anyway, this is uh, Porto Mayo. Yeah. And we're just having a look around. And very cute. you can see there's sidewalk cafes. And there's this rather impressive fountain right in the center and just a very nice area on the river. Come down to the riverside team. Whoa, and look at the palm trees. So here's the riverside, it's got some palm trees. We can see storks flying around as well, can't we? We can. So we just parked our car and we could hear the clack, clack, clack of the, <laughs> uh, the storks. Yeah. So they're nesting in the area. And this is the... I guess the, 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 the promenade? Or? Yeah, like the promenade runs along the river front and there's lots of boats here. Used to be a big fishing area. It's very so, pretty, isn't it? So we're exploring on our nice day out from Praia do Roca to Porto Mayo. So here's the palm trees on the front at Porto Mayo. It's just beautiful today. Um, and it's a beautiful walk and it's all cobbled like the typical Portuguese style and then as we turn around there's this like city square and there's all sorts of uh, food concession stands. Aren't these concession stands so colourful team? Aren't they pretty? They're like traditional architecture and Ola ice cream is obviously <laughs> doing good business here. Yeah, yeah. this is a, an ice cream st a stand so it's just uh, a beautiful area you can sit, enjoy some coffee, ice cream in the centre at Porto Mayo, looking at the river. Look at the dancing fountain. Wow. Isn't that, oh, isn't that beautiful? You know what? I love fountains like this. There's so many of these little towns here. It'd be even better Portugal. if it was wine that was shooting out of there, oh, do you think? Oh, well, that would be even better if they gave everybody a glass to catch it. <laughs> So if you look over there, that's sort of a whole pile of it there, yeah. but it's almost like they're, they're playing Misty. music, isn't it? Yeah. Very, so, very pretty. It's very well done. So this is just looking back along the front at Porto Mayo. It stretches all the way around here that we can walk. Um, and you can see that there's a galleon here that... Yeah, one of those really old ships. Well, it's probably a replica. <laughs> and so you can go have a, a cruise on that as well. So this is very much a tale of two towns, Praia do Roca, Porto Mayo. Uh, one's a beach resort and one's a, a town on a river and they're joined at the hip. So one of the great things about Portugal are the colors, Tim. They are, like the, the colors of the buildings. Absolutely stunning. They are. Even this is a bit of a derelict building in Porto Mayo. But just look at the intensity of the yellow and it's, it's beautiful, isn't it? It really is. And that's one of the joys of seeing the architecture in the Algarve and Portugal generally. It's just beautiful. It is. It's really nice. We very much enjoy it, don't we? We do. So we just thought we'd photograph ourselves in front of a yellow building that could do with a lick of paint. Yeah. <laughs>